Corbett's life began on February 12, 1976, in the eerie town of Limerick, Ireland, a place where dark clouds often shrouded the sky, casting an unsettling pall over the landscape. His family, a large brood of eight children, was perpetually joyous on the surface. John and Rita, the parents, toiled tirelessly to ensure their offspring grew up robust and wanting for nothing, even in the face of perpetual financial struggles. Jason shared a mysterious connection with his twin brother, Wayne, an unspoken bond that transcended mere words. In times of dire financial straits, when their father's employment faltered, Jason unflinchingly took up the mantle of a part-time security guard at the local school sports center. His relentless pursuit of extra income reflected an unwavering dedication to supporting his loved ones. The ethic of hard work was a compass guiding Jason's life, endearing him to family and friends alike. Among those deeply touched by his spirit was Margaret Fitzpatrick, known simply as Meg. Their fateful meeting left no doubt in anyone's mind they were fated for one another. Their love blossomed into a sacred union, and in September 2004, their first child, Jack, graced their lives. Two years hence, the family welcomed another precious addition, a daughter named Sarah. During those early years, the Corbett's reveled in true happiness, wrapped in the embrace of love, their lives seemingly perfect. Yet, the story took a haunting turn on November 21, 2006, a mere three months after Sarah's birth. A sinister tragedy descended upon the family that fateful night, as Meg awoke with a familiar asthma attack. In a cruel twist of fate, the nebulizer failed to provide relief, and Jason raced her to the hospital. Time, unforgivingly, slipped away, and the 31-year-old mother succumbed, leaving Jason, now 30, and alone to face a void impossible to articulate. No words could capture the depths of his grief. On that devastating day, Jason received a call from the hospital, summoning him urgently. His sister, Tracy, recalled the profound sorrow etched onto his face, but his children awaited him at home, and he knew he had to stand strong for their sake. His family rallied to his side, offering unwavering support, though it pained Jason to lean on them. Fearing the burden he placed on his loved ones, he resolved to hire an au pair. In 2007, his plan came to fruition. The initial candidates proved unsuitable, lacking the permanence he saw. Jason yearned for someone who would become a steadfast presence in his family's life. In February 2008, an email arrived that would alter their course. Molly Martins, 20 years old, reached out, her resume cloaked in falsehoods. She arrived in Ireland from Knoxville, Tennessee, on March 10, 2008, seeking a new chapter in her life. While their connection initially seemed promising, life's eerie unpredictability would soon disrupt their shared narrative. Custody disputes, emotional turmoil, and allegations of abuse led to a tempestuous relationship. Molly's desires to adopt children clashed with Jason's reluctance. Tensions mounted, leading Jason to contemplate divorce and a return to Ireland with his beloved children. He concealed the children's passports, fearing Molly's reaction. Then, in the early hours of August 2, 2015, a nightmarish incident unfolded. Molly claimed self-defense, recounting a harrowing altercation between her father, Tom, and Jason. Jason's life ended brutally, his body bearing gruesome injuries, a murky cloud of conflicting testimonies, motive, and forensic evidence shrouded the case. Amidst allegations, revelations, and legal battles, Jason's family sought justice. Molly and Tom were arrested, tried, and sentenced to prison. However, in 2021, they were released on bail, pending a retrial, further compounding the eerie twists of this haunting saga. As the tale unfolds, Jason's children, Jack and Sarah, have grown into young adults, carrying the weight of their father's legacy and a relentless pursuit of justice. The story continues to unfold, with a looming retrial that promises to bring new revelations to light. The eerie enigma of Jason Corbett's life and death continues to grip us, inviting us to witness a conclusion yet to be written.